Study number one, can red light therapy reverse hearing loss? The effect of near-infrared light on hearing loss following chemotherapy administration was evaluated in mice. Hearing was assessed following gentamicin administration and again 10 days after light therapy. The effect of near-infrared light on hearing loss following chemotherapy poisoning was evaluated. Hearing was assessed following gentamicin administration and again after 10 days of light therapy. On scanning electron microscopic images, low-level laser therapy significantly increased the number of hair cells in middle and basal turns. Hearing was significantly improved by laser radiation. After low-level laser therapy treatment, both the hearing threshold and hair cell count significantly improved. So the near-infrared light made the hair cells regrow and improved the hearing at the same time. Near-infrared light administered after chemical poisoning can regrow cochlear hair cells and restore hearing in mice. Study number two. In this study, rats were exposed to intense noise in both ears. Afterwards, the right ears were irradiated with near-infrared light for 30-minute treatments every day for five days. So the results of the study were as follows. Measurement of the auditory brainstem response revealed an accelerated recovery of auditory function in the groups treated with low-level lasers compared with the non-treated groups at days 2, 4, 7, and 14 after noise exposure. Morphological observations also revealed a significantly higher outer hair cell survival rate in the low-level laser therapy groups. Looking for indicators of oxidative stress in apoptosis in untreated versus treated cells, researchers found strong immunoreactivities in the inner ear tissues of the non-treatment group, whereas these signals were decreased in the low-level laser therapy group. Our findings suggest that low-level laser therapy has cytoprotective effects against noise-induced hearing loss via the inhibition of nitric oxide expression and apoptosis. There you have it. Next study. In a 2012 study, nine rats were exposed to loud noise and the use of near-infrared light on hearing recovery was tested. The day after loud noise exposure, the left ears of the rats were treated with near-infrared light for 60 minutes for 12 days in a row. The right ears were left untreated and were considered the control group. After the 12th irradiation, hearing threshold was significantly lower for the left ears compared to the right ears. When observed using an electron microscope, the number of auditory hair cells in the treated ears was significantly greater than in of the untreated ears. Our findings suggest that low-level laser irradiation promotes recovery of hearing threshold after acute acoustic trauma. There you go. So once again, the exact same thing happened. The hair cells were protected and the hearing improved. Hey, it's Mark. Thank you for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and definitely hit subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos when they come out. Also, be sure to pick up my three free eBooks, one on chemotherapy, the other on sodium bicarbonate for cancer and other diseases, and a red light therapy dose guide by clicking the link in the description below. Last but not least, check out one more video on my channel right here, and I will see you in the next one.